We are on Musk Visa Lastine Day. One of my favorites, so this is a new bottle. Let's open her up first. They come like this, foil sealed. And just peel it up and remove. Sorry. Ooh. Okay, in the rubbish. First, I want to clean the skin. Um, I like to do this because I feel that it makes the product go into the skin a bit more. Um, and that's obviously very important. So, dab dab. My skin is much better. I'm creating. Oh, get some lights on. Um, much happier. Sorry, I can't really see how good is this lighting. Um, but you can look at the rest of the videos, and my skin has gotten so much better day by day after night. It's crazy. Um, so this stuff really works. And um, yeah, I. Pretty happy because my forehead is clear, that rash is gone. Um, yeah, I have a couple of breakouts that are kind of healing, but there's no problems. So what my maintenance will be after this is mask vivant. If I get any breakouts, just put it on the spot anywhere it is. Um, put the mask VIPO2 under the eyes and um, I would do mask visalastine once a week. Um, I would do must be bad twice a week. I would do must be IPO two, two to three times a week, depending on how dehydrated you feel. Um, but with my amber oils, I don't tend to need to do so many masks because I will either sleep with it or I'll put it on for half a day. And the reason I boot half a day with amber is because it's very, very hot here. Um, it's about 30 degrees each day and I just don't want like I, I splash my face with water through the day and I just prefer to have it completely nothing on my skin um, as I will be rubbing it off anyway and that would just be a waste of my t time and resources and monies and whatever you want to say. So, oh, that's not very attractive. <laughs> ah, okay, anyway, whatever. Should be covering the hair for a minute. There we go. Okay. This one. Mask Visa Lasting. Here we go. First time using what color? White. Okay. No smell. I keep my products in the fridge and it's very nice on the skin to be cold, um, refreshing, and then, you know, just dries on your skin and warms up. for use. Apply mask Visalastine in a thin layer to the face, neck and decolletage. Allow the mask to act for 15 to 20 minutes then remove by rinsing with tepid water. Avoid contact with eyes. Um, it says external use only, like we're not going to eat it. Um, I think though it can go, like it should be able to go a bit closer into the eye, under eye. Obviously you don't get it in the eye. Um, and the important parts are near your ears because this is, needs to be the strongest part around here. acid. I want to talk about that a little bit um, to show you how I apply it and I think it's pretty amazing how it warms up by application. Um, Alright so they're amazing dropper balls so that you're not contaminating something. I'll just put it on my finger for now. Uh, put two drops. And rub rub. Okay. 
Okay. So. So, I swear it lightens straight away because alpha lipoic acid is an acid. Um, so it's getting deeper into the skin, like deeper than the oils, like vitamin E oil that you're supposed to put on scars. And I've been doing that and I saw nothing. Um, I had a healing cream gel after and not really much change, um, but this actually seems to have more of a change than what I've seen over the last month, I guess. Um, I'm going to try applying for a couple of weeks. I wouldn't expect to see anything overnight, for sure. Actually, I'm going to put down my neck because I already see some... Two drops. Some of those lines, like indent lines. I guess someone would call them fine lines if they would like. Yeah, but this is supposed to help with anti-aging, so we're gonna put on the neck. Okay. And then we let this sit for 20 minutes. Okay, this is how we look now, mask Viselastin after 20 minutes. Um, feels good. Not um, not stiff, dry, um, but it does make that kind of texture when you rub it on. Um, so now I'm just going to wipe it off and let's see how it looks after. What I love about the sponge is that it, it stops me from being rough on my skin because I think I, um, I tend to be maybe a little bit more rough in my wiping, I've never really thought about, oh, which direction am I wiping upwards? Um, but with this, it kind of, it's like you're supposed to go in circles, so you can't really go wrong with this one. My skin quality looks better. Masks are a huge deal. When I get back to China, I will start doing the paper masks um, and talk about the different paper masks that are available in China. There are so many paper masks available um, and the price is right and here they're not. <laughs> um, in, in Australia, one mask is around two dollars and I think that's a little bit crazy because it's not that you're going to use that um, more times, you use it once and you throw it away. Um, you may as well buy those ones that you soak uh, expandable, they come in like a little circle and then you put it into the liquid, it expands and you put that on your face. Um, I don't know if they're reusable or not, but um, it would be much more cost effective um, and um, you could do it more often, like if you didn't have access to cheaper options. And uh, yeah. So, guess who's going to the hairdresser now? Actually, I didn't brush my <laughs> wash my hair. So I got um, oh, what do you call it? Hairspray. Anyway, much better. I don't want to wear makeup today. Feeling fresh. Maybe that's my new favorite mask. So I can do mask every week. I would do one night mask with Elastine VIP O2 and mask Viva because in China I'm tired and I'm wearing a lot of makeup. My skin is stressed, pollution, um, dryness, tiredness, everything you want to say. Too much coffee. So yeah, yeah.